welcome back to Alliance Bridal here in Moose Creek. And meet Kiera, our little flower girl for the day. How adorable is she? And this is your granddaughter. Right. So she was the fourth generation. Fourth generation. And we have your daughter over here on the side, who's the third. And third generation. So yep. it's, it's a full family affair here. Absolutely. And you guys have had this shop for quite a few years. Uh, I've been in business for 42 years. This is our new store. It's 8,000 square feet. Yeah, and thousands of dresses. And we're looking at uh, some of the beautiful ones here today. Now, this is, you were saying, a very vintage style look. Very vintage style. They love this uh, back here cut out lace. So we'll turn around here. To the front. Mm hmm to the front. And are we seeing lace a lot this uh, spring and summer? Lots and lots of lace. Yeah. yeah. The co companies can't furnish the demand in lace right now. Really? So yeah. it's like the thing to go with. Yeah, and our top designers right now are Morley. Yep. And uh, Allure and uh, Maggie Sotero. Okay. And we are exclusive in this area <laughs> with these designers. <laughs> she was camera shy, now she's not anymore. <laughs> <No. right? laughs> now she wants to steal the show. Yeah, now she wants to steal the show. <laughs> and what about the belt? Is this something that was added on here? No. That that comes with it, okay. and the vintage brooch on there makes it just enough bling. And right. Yeah. And now, because the neck is so V and you have the little capsie, would you add um, a veil because there is already so much lace, or is it kind of up to the bride? Up to the bride. Like right now, the younger generation doesn't seem to like veils no. as much as we do, but uh, uh, we're seeing a lot of longer earrings and bracelets. And okay, so a bit more bling. On the necklace. Yeah. And what about the price point for this dress here? Uh, this is uh, twelve hundred. They said. Wow. Yes. <laughs> 1100? <laughs> okay. And this one is a Maggie Sotero. Mm -hmm. Is 15. 15. And talk yep. a bit about this dress. This is because they're quite different. We're looking yep. at two totally different dresses. This has a crinoline underneath. Okay. So it's a bigger dress. Um, but again, embellished with the belt. So uh, that's an added belt as well. Yeah. And uh, just makes. Uh, and this is quite a unique style because I'm seeing the underneath is kind of different than the top. Is that a new trend we're seeing? Yeah, or that that we're seeing the satin in insert there, and uh, uh, we often see girls wearing cowboy boots under these oh, dresses. Oh, really? Yeah. That's interesting. Yeah, very feminine and look. And now she's chosen a veil. Is this a veil that comes with, or are the veils separate? The veils are separate, and this particular one is all edged in Swarovski crystal. Oh, it's gorgeous. Yeah, so this adds the added bling. And what about the headpiece on the top? Is that part of the veil, or is that? No, that's separate in Swarovski crystal as well. So it kind of matches with the uh, very. Yeah. Very nice. And yeah. now you have tons of stylists. I've seen them been working the corners all morning. They know the ins and out of the store like yeah, I haven't absolutely. seen. Absolutely, yeah. yeah. <laughs> they know the dresses, where to find them, the price points, the designs. Absolutely, and we have a mother of the bride That's right. There's one very important thing we don't want to forget is the mother of the bride. So you also cater to people who are attending weddings as well. For sure, for sure. So what do you recommend for mother of the bride? Um, young dresses usually is the big demand. They want something to make them look flatter, uh, figure flatter flattering yeah and look young of course mm -hmm. and uh, god forbid the um, uh, <laughs> second most important person at a wedding is the mother of the bride because that's right <laughs> if it wasn't for the mother of the bride there'd be no wedding <laughs> that's so true and so what is the look that we're seeing here it's a ruched um, stretchy knit material in navy blue and um, louise wears it very nicely it looks stunning and it actually looks really comfortable which is also something that's very important in as well right? very nice well thank yep. you so much for having us here today Today. And for people who want to check out your shop, you're located in Moose Creek, really easy to find. 25 minutes away from Ottawa. And you also have a website with uh, all your information. All our information and all our designers on, on the website. Thank you again for having us today. It's been an absolute pleasure. Thank you.